Good day. Thank you for joining me for another episode of Atari 8-Bit Game Play. So I'm going to play a game. I'm going to try this uh, next next game on the compilation disc, the Games 476 by Homesoft, an amazing service for the Atari the Atari World community. And next up is Dark City Road. Here we go. Uh, you know what? I should have looked up what... Re Whoa! Dark City Road. Very nice screen. Uh, I'm just actually going to see if I can find this one. Although I think I probably have the wrong region. Okay, no, no entry on Atari Mania. So I'm not going to spend any more time hunting for that. I think probably the odds are it's a European release, so it's going to be PAL. PAL video mode. Um, I have no idea what kind of game this is. I do like that screen though. That's really nice. That's really nice. Um, okay. It's fire button. Uh, oh, another Zdenda game. Zdenic Zuber. This guy is amazing. Or gal. I have no idea. You have to kill 10 people. Press start. I guess that would be the... Oh, oh, I'm a car. Oh, nice. Oops. Car crash, car crash, car crash. Oops. Car crash, car crash, car crash. Okay. I get the feel. That was such a nice title screen, though. Oh, this is tricky. I wonder if I should try this with a joypad. Oh, there's a fuel gauge, too. What's this? I don't know what that is. Oh, fuel. Remains 10. Okay, so you don't seem to have lives. Okay, you just hit them. Oops, I kind of assumed I was going to be able to drive through those buildings. That's not the case. Ah, come on. Okay, so apparently you have fuel but no lives, so... All right, maybe I should go back to keyboard play. We'll see. Oh, come on. Yeah. I don't know. A little tricky. Oh, there's a fuel pump. Okay. There's a, a person and a person and a person and a fuel pump. Nice sound effects in this game. Or at least... Well, yeah, there's some sound effects. That's one thing that Mr. Zuber doesn't have lots of in his games. Coded by Zdenda in Pure Assembler. Oh, dang it, I was doing so well. Well, I... Oh, come on. I have to say, Mr. Zuber has really come quite a ways. He's really... I shouldn't say he, I don't really know. I'm, I'm just assuming it's a male... whoops, a male name. But um, just really, really great programmer. Um, developing kind of right before our eyes even. I mean, I am not that, so I'm impressed. Okay, we're full up. Uh, let's see if I can maybe go this way. Oh, crap. Okay, that's actually a dead end. I can see music by poison. I can see it's a dead end, so... That does not bear any further exploration, and... So I'm going to come up here, get some gas. And, uh... <laughs> Smoked another person. Five... Oh, little zappy wall. And you start back from the corner each time. That's kind of annoying, actually. It'd be kind of nice if you started from the last fuel pump or something. 
or if there were maybe some checkpoints that you could uh, get to. Oh, this comes to the same spot. Interesting. Definitely need to fill up. This car, this car burns fuel quite, quite fast. I guess the old death machines take a bit of fuel. Car graphics by PG. Oh, whoops. Dag Narbit. Darg Blargit. I have yet to figure out how to come back this direction. Okay, I think I'll take the take this opportunity to fill up with gas. direction. Three people to murder. Oh, crap. Dag, blag it. This was the way, right? No, this is not. Ah! Uh, <laughs> good thing there's not lives in this game. <laughs> Just when I think I'm getting better, I, I'm sadly reminded that that is not necessarily the case. This was the way. Gotta remember. Oh, for Pete's sake. Ah, uh, gotta avoid these stupid electro walls. Okay, so... Oh, come on. Robert, what are you doing? Okay, so if you're too close to the wall, when you straighten out, you crash into the wall, which is not ideal. Makes it a little tougher, for sure. You kind of have to stay to the middle of the roadways, or reasonably close to the middle. Okay. This is as far as I've gotten down this track. Paranoid about electro walls now. Well, where did I? I'm missing two dudes. Oh, where the heck are they? Where the heck are those two? Those two pedestrians. How dare they? Oops, how dare they avoid my wrath? Oop, 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 oop. Okay, so that, there's nothing there. Okay, so I explored all that area. Oh, for Pete's sake. Oh, for Pete's sake. Ooh, that was just about me going head on into an electro wall. So where are the remaining, whoops. Dang it. Where are the remaining pedestrians, man? That's what I want to know. 
so I can run them over and get to level 2 if there is a level 2. Is it going to be this way? Did I not go this way already? I believe I did. Oh. Robert. There we go. This is quite an extensive uh, level. There we go. Prepare to meet your fate. Oh, victory! I was kind of expecting a level two. Um, I guess I win. <laughs> is there a different maze? Oh, maybe the pedestrians are in different places. That's what it is. Yeah, that's what it is. Okay, well that that gives some variety of gameplay. That's all right. Or are they? No, I think they are. Okay, yeah. Blam, blam. Definitely in different places. I've already I've already murdered five of them. Okay, well that that yeah that's okay. That's a nice that's a nice way to uh, give some very vari variation to the gameplay variety. I mean not real variety, but. You can sort of learn the whole maze and get good at driving around and everything. Cool. I think, though, that is going to do it for my look at at um, Dark City Road. So, uh, actually, what I'm going to do is drive over here and park myself like that so I can uh, make a screenshot of this part of the game and use that for my title card. <laughs> and uh, this is going to go out almost a month, almost a month from the time I'm recording it. Oh, there goes the car. Oh, let's see what happens when you run, run out of fuel. Boom. Fuel out. Game over. Ah, game over if you run out of fuel. Well, the fuel pumps are, in fact, reasonably plentiful, so not, not a big concern. Right. I think I'm done. I think I'm done. Thank you so much for watching. Take good care of yourselves, and I'll see you next time.